So here's your home screen. Settings screen. This is where you can go and put the date. Select your units of measure. Change your colors of your buttons or your back screen. Brightness. All that. Vehicle information page. That's going to give you all of your vehicle information. Coolant temperature, oil pressure, load. And all these screens, as you can see, we still have the three main displays that you selected. In the event that you want to change one of these, you can just simply hold it for a second or two. This is going to be your option, so if we wanted to have our compass GPS instead, we would select that. That's going to keep that on any, of, any one of your pages. So. Camera page. This will either come on by putting it in reverse or selecting the soft key in the event that you want to be driving forward with the camera. You've got your manual page. Here's where you're going to be able to select from the different manuals. Either you know, we, can, we can look at our engine troubleshooting guide. Scroll through the pages, page by page. This is all the information you need to know if you're trying to troubleshoot what's happening in the field. So, pretty cool. Diagnostics page is going to give you a list of any codes that have popped up in the event that you're working with your dealer to again troubleshoot or you know just see what's happening with the vehicle. This is where you have that cooling fan purge option. So in the event that the screens are plugged on the outside of the vehicle from going through a bunch of cattails or whatever, by hitting the pan the purge button. It's going to reverse the direction of the fan. It's going to push all that debris out. Run for about 10 seconds. It'll wind back down and then go back to pulling air back through the radiator as it normally would. You can click night mode if you're operating at night. It's going to dim the screen and just give you better visibility here inside the cab in the dark hours of the day. We're not there, so back to home and on the right hand side here this is all for your ATC it allows you to select from the pre-programmed settings for your tire pressures it's going to give you what each setting target is and if you choose a different pressure than that you simply can just use these soft keys on the bottom